Okay, if we're going to get into detrital sedimentary rocks, um, the first thing that we want to recognize is the type of weathering that occurs to create the sediment. And that uh, weathering is mechanical weathering. So these are sort of examples we see um, by water. If you ever see a stream valley that's been eroded away by a river running through it, then that's an example of weathering by water. Also, you can get weathering by wind, as shown in this very arid region in the bottom photograph here. Uh, so this is how existing rocks and particles get further broken down to a small enough size to be transported as sediment. The chief constituents of, of the trital rocks make up any type of pre-existing rock or mineral material. Usually includes clay. Um, quartz is a very common constituent because quartz is so hard and it doesn't weather, so it breaks apart rather than breaking down. So you'll find it a lot at the beach, um, as you know, and that uh, what makes sandstones. And then others include feldspars and micas. So these are the type of minerals that you'll find in detrital sedimentary rocks. And meaning, uh, remember, detrital means from the earth, from land.